everyone, my name is Alex. Myself and my partner, Max, uh, who's also going to be in the vlog, are going on a bit of a epic adventure to Disney's Ulani Resort and then on a Disney cruise. But we will give you a bit more detail on that once we uh, get going. Join along. I thought this is a bit of a once in a lifetime trip. So for myself and other people, I thought we'd document it and uh, so we can look back on it. And hopefully we can show you some amazing adventures. Oh, I forgot to say as well, Max isn't here right now. He's at work. So I've been doing everything today, preparing everything. I hope I've got everything packed. I feel a lot of responsibility. Let me show you the lists that I've had the responsibility of checking. I've got everything list. 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 Got help as if I've missed something on there. Let's get Max. I'm just going to give you a little room tour, but I'll apologise in advance. It's really messy because we've already slept here and I completely forgot to uh, film it. So here you go. So we're staying in 1301 at the Hilton Garden Inn, Heathrow Terminal 2 and 3. But this is a corner room that we've got. The normal rooms just have one window. It's a family corner room. You walk in, you've got a nice big mirror. My mystery cases, I'm sorry. Work desk with a mini fridge. All your kettles. Mirror. Into the bathroom. By the way, these toiletries, they smell really nice. You've got your hand wash, body lotion. Nice little artwork. And then they've got the same toiletries on the wall there. Shower gel, shampoo, conditioner. The rainforest shower. Rainforest? Rainfall shower? Look out. Now you have got a, the, this sofa bed was made for us last night, but we just shoved it back together because we didn't need it. Hey Max. Hi Max. Hair dryer's up there. You've got an iron, ironing board. There's your iron. Nice bed. One thing I'll say about the bed is it's very springy and the pillows were a bit naff, but what do you think? Yeah, I think it's a great room. The size is brilliant. Um, nice to have two windows, two angles of the runway. Um, but yeah, okay. I've got the plant. This is the best view though. I literally hid behind the curtains this morning because Max was still asleep, but I wanted to watch the planes. So, there we go. We're now off to go and check in. See you soon. Woo. Are we doing an outfit of the day? Is that something we do? This is my travel day. I've got my linen blend joggers from Abercrombie, medium tops from Converse. This t-shirt's from Vinted. It's a Zara top from Vinted, I paid four pounds. Duh. And I have no idea where half my stuff is from. <laughs> Zara. 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 And the Stan Smiths. Stan Smiths. Yeah. Uh, okay. <laughs> okay, now we need to go. We're already late checking out. Bye. This is ridiculous. So if you're flying up a class, you get your own lift and carpet. I think it's probably that. I think these are it. If anyone's seen. Tobler and have started doing new like triple chocolates, but I don't know if this is them. 
Tell me then, I think so. Shall we just get one? If you want some, yeah. Thank you. Now we could just take the stairs as it's only there, but you'll see why. <laughs> There's a little sofa, little feet. <sighs> to enjoy while you're going up one floor. Second floor. Thank you. <gasps> Welcome to the clubhouse. Oh. oh, this is nice. I've seen people, there's a rooftop. <gasps> it's up here. So in Virgin's upper class lounge, they have a rooftop garden, which, wow. So I've just realised we haven't actually introduced Max yet, even though we've been talking about him. So here he is. Hi everyone. <laughs> I'm Max. This is Max. someone coming around filling up champagne but she's walked away. So we've just ordered some food in the clubhouse. Let me show you what we've got. I went for roasted red pepper and tomato, and tomato soup, a chicken Caesar salad and Max has got a chicken tikka masala. I'm going to try and get you to touch my body. Oh, I've just crashed into myself. I'm supposed to get you to touch my body. Stop <laughs> <laughs> it. No, you need to give me some money. You've got 14, I've only got 6. I don't know. <laughs> what is it? It's, um, it's an app that's called Two Player Games and it's got a load of different Just like random games on there. Two Player <laughs> Games on it. But yeah, it's quite funny. <laughs> Sorry. You have to pass the time somehow. Don't you? <laughs> Sorry for disturbing the peace. <laughs> so we've been chilling in the lounge for a few hours, haven't we? And oh yeah, so we've been in this lounge for a couple of hours. Well, we're taking full advantage of it because we've been here for four hours now, ordering a lot of things off the menu. <laughs> By the way, these Toblerones that I got, they are delicious. However, I didn't realise how expensive they were until I got to the till. They're twenty pounds. Twenty pounds for a box of Toblerones. Box of chocolates. But they are delicious. They are. Anyway. Let's talk about what we're actually doing on this trip. Yep. So, we are currently at London Heathrow Airport, and from here we are flying to uh, San, San Francisco. Francisco, and we are then staying over the night in San Francisco at... What hotel? The Grand Hyatt. The Grand Hyatt. SFO. Yeah. Um, just staying there one night, and then tomorrow morning we are taking Hawaiian Airlines, Flying from San Francisco to Hawaii. Uh, Oahu. Oahu. <coughs> yeah. Um, so then from there, we are then staying three nights in Disney's Ulani Resort. And um, then after that, we are then catching the Disney transfer from Ulani Resort to the port terminal, aren't we? Yeah. Where we are then getting on the Disney, Disney Wonder. Wonder cruise ship and then we are doing a two week Pacific 
cruise. Trans-Pacific cruise to yeah. Sydney. Sydney in Australia, uh, calling at Fiji, uh, American Samoa and New Caledonia on the way. Um, so then once we dock in Sydney the other side, uh, we are then staying at... We're staying at the Four Seasons for five nights in Sydney. Yeah. Um, and then we've also got a few like little excursions booked in Sydney, haven't we? Yeah, um, so I've booked um, a trip for us to go to the Blue Mountains. Um, it's like an all day thing, they pick you up at half past eight. It's like a, a mini bus with about 10 people on. They take you to the Blue Mountains, photo ops, they speak, uh, you get to speak to people about the Blue Mountains. Um, provide lunch, don't they? Oh yes, you get lunch. Um, there's like a, a cable car which goes from what's it called ravine a yeah like cliff. over a, yeah a bit of a ravine yeah and then you get to go on the it's like the world's steepest railway i don't know if it's the world's steepest railway but it's very steep um and then after that's done they then take you to the zoo it's a fitney is it called a funicular railway that goes up what? the side a funicular railway i don't know that goes Does up the side of mine i don't know you can let us know in the comments um uh, so then they take you to the zoo and you can hug a koala, I think. Um, and then you go on a boat and go down the Sydney Harbour and then you get dropped off there. So that uh, is our exciting 25 night trip that we've got planned. Around the world trip, literally. Yeah. So we'll li then we fly from Sydney with Qantas to stop to Singapore then back to London so we are literally doing one whole trip around the globe so we will lose a day so this Interesting year in fact our years only consist of 364 days this year there we go but no right so one thing this clubhouse is amazing it really is so yeah so if you can afford to do upper class definitely but, come and use the clubhouse yes but we haven't paid full for upper class we've used our points that we've accumulated with Virgin and then you just pay the taxes and fees, so we haven't paid like ridiculous amounts of money to fly up a class. We just used our points, so. Yeah. All right then. Well, we are about to go to the gate, aren't we? Yeah. So we'll catch you shortly. We have just met such a lovely lady in the clubhouse, Paula. She works in there. Disney fan, like us. Lovely to meet you. Lovely. Thank you.
into leg room. This comes out. TV here. Pops out from there. Tray table, which I think. Oh yeah, that comes around. Welcome. Where's where's the light switch? Oh, oh! It came on. I don't know how. Uh, um. That's nice. Wow. Oh, yep, yeah, it's toilet. <laughs> Shoe bag. Oh, a shoe on. Mm -hmm. Oh, we've got robes and slippers, mate. Oh, good. Oh, and a foam massage roller. Oh, just what you need. Yeah. That's nice. And welcome to the San Francisco. Oh my God, all the cars. You can get this room with a uh, runway view, but we haven't got that. How into you instead? We are on the second to top floor. Nespresso machine. Oh, the waters are included as well. Is there a mini fridge? Yeah, there's the mini fridge. What's in here? A cupboard. Safe. 
like it. It's nice. The bathroom's lovely. Yeah, it's spacious. There's your makeup uh, cloth for you. For you. Hi. So we have landed in San Francisco and we have got to a hotel. We checked into the Grand Hyatt at SFO for one night and then we've got a, well, we're only here for five hours, six yeah. hours. And then we are up bright and early in the morning, uh, back to the airport to catch the plane to Hawaii. How was your flight? Really, really good. Um, it was great. Uh, the staff were lovely. Mikey and the crew really, really looked after us. So thanks to all the Virgin staff. Um, but you always get a great service. With They're Virgin, always amazing. Don't you? So, yeah, they um, really are. And the food was really nice. They said it was the new uh, autumn winter menu. Oh, yeah, it was delicious. Yeah, it was very, very good. I had. I don't think I filmed it, but I had a a snack of a. Is it a bower bun? Yeah, I think so. A uh, chicken bower bun. It was so nice. Yeah. Um, and for the main meal, I think we both had... Um, Roast chicken. Yeah. And a ham star, didn't we? Yeah. Like in Serrano ham or yeah. whatever it's called. Uh, yeah, that was really, really good. Um, we're very tired. Very tired. So we're going to get some sleep now. And we'll see you tomorrow, bright and early. Good night. Good night. God. What? I look tired. You're okay. I think it's your our eyes. Maybe we should have put some of them eye things on. Morning everyone. <laughs> uh, we've just woken up at San Francisco, uh the Hyatt Regency. Grand Hyatt Regent. It's not a region is it a no. regency? Uh, it's just Grand Hyatt Grand, at Grand, SFO. Yeah, the Grand Hyatt at SFO. Sorry, giving you double information um ready for our second flight of the trip yeah so like we say today we're flying from san francisco to hawaii with hawaiian airlines mm -hmm. flight time is approximately five and a half hours five and a half hours you sound like you're uh, the captain flight time today will be approximately five and a half hours maybe i was in a former life who knows um how did you sleep I slept very well. No, I'm Thank glad you. you did. This bed was extremely comfy. The duvet was lovely. Pillows were okay. One thing that's amazing that every hotel should do, they have a little night lights underneath the bed, which sense when someone gets out. So a little light appears on your side of the bed. But not very bright. Not very bright, but just so you can see. So if you're going for a wee in the night, and in the bathroom, there's a little night light which comes on, which is brilliant. Yeah, it's great. So, what time is it? Half past five. Half past five in the morning, yeah. So we're just going to check out now, head back over to the Packing up. airport and probably grab a coffee on the By the way. way, it's really easy to get to this hotel. It's on the air train link at San Francisco. So when you arrive, it's two stops. Yeah, so you go and up, straight up in, down. Up in the lift to level four, which is where the, the tram goes around. Isn't yeah. It? And then, yeah, it's literally just two stops. Two stops. And then you're here. So, yes. <laughs> so this is the outfit of the day. Second travel Second. outfit of the day. Yeah. Well, no, it's the first travel outfit of this day. Second travel outfit of the day overall. Yeah. What are you wearing, Alex? There's going to be a running theme, I believe, here. Abercrombie again. This is a t-shirt from Reese. Shorts, Abercrombie, Converse, next. Nice. Uh, back t-shirt from... Zara. This is another running theme with you. Zara, no, these are Eminence. Oh, are they? I believe, yeah, and then still got my Stan Smiths on. So that's it. Let's go catch a flight. Just a bit of an overview of the hotel. I'm out of breath when I come down my lifts. Here's a little coffee store. Lovely, lovely. 
I assume it's open. Uh, and then in the main reception area, you can see all the planes. So we're all checked in. We just come and got some uh, breakfast. Hang on, where have we got it from? Hang on. Food in. Egg, bacon, and cheese on sourdough. Tasty. What is that? Kind of chocolate. Um, and I've got a uh, wrap, some water. Latte, cappuccino. Latte, cappuccino. 50 something dollars. Five dollars. Fifty-five dollars. Fifty-five dollars. Come on. Away. clear for others. If you're seated in an exit row, we may ask you to assist us in the unlikely event of. Here's our seat. These are the extra comfort seats. There's just literally one row of seats here. And there's the wall. We are staring at first class though in there. Aloha and welcome aboard. Aloha, mahalo iki, kipa anamai. For your comfort and safety, please fasten your seatbelt. Insert the flat end into the buckle. Pull the strap to tighten. It's turned off. Laptops and items equivalent in size must be stowed during taxi, takeoff, and landing. Completely beneath the seat in front of you. Or in the overhead compartment. For guests in our business or first class cabin, please ensure that your foot and leg rest are in the stowed position. On behalf of all of us here at Hawaiian Airlines, thank you very much for choosing to fly with us. Mahalo ike alauna pu anamai. Enjoy your flight.
It's room checking time. We are number 1068. So 10th floor, room 68, and Alex is just about to check us in. Surfing now. Oh. What's in there, Alex? Safe and a laundry basket mm -hmm. and hangers. Mm -hmm. We have a dining room table. And then a look at another hidden Mickey. Full oven. In case you want to do any cooking while you're here. We've got a dishwasher, a rice cooker in case you want to cook your rice. Microwave, fridge. What's in here? Ah. There's the washer dryer. Washer dryer. We can take that with us to the cruise. And then follow me into the bathroom. Nice big shower. That's a lovely shower. Kitchen. H2O products. H2O products, but the individual ones, not pumps. Not big, not big pumps. And then through here into the bathroom. Oh, look, you can watch me bathe. Mm -hmm. I think I'll watch Steve. Oh, like, uh, yes. <laughs> What's in there? You block every door that you open. Sorry. <laughs> we have an emergency torch. Oh. For kids? Yeah, it's a travel cot. A travel cot and hangers and uh, storage. Yeah. And then into the bedroom, that is a massive, massive bed. Massive bed. <gasps> um, um. Sorry, have fun. What is this? What is Beautiful. That's what we're going to wake up to every morning. And here's this lamp I want to ah. buy. I mean, the famous it. Mickey Surf board lamp. Brilliant. Is there a bird in here somewhere? No, I think it's TV sound. Oh. So that's our room. What do you think, Al? It's very, very, very nice. Make a badge. Woken up uh, after our first full night at Ulani. Um, and how did you sleep? Good. 
the beds are the typical Disney beds where you just sink into them. Yeah. And they they're are. huge as well. Yeah, and they're massive. And the pillows are really good, aren't they, as well? Yeah. We, um, we didn't really vlog a lot of our arrival yesterday. It was all just a bit overwhelming. Yeah, there was so a, a lot. There was a lot of people, of people here, here because the Disney Wonder, which is the ship that we're going on shortly, is currently doing a cruise from Vancouver to Hawaii. Yeah, isn't it? And one of the stops was yesterday here. Yeah. Um, on a, oh, Oahu. 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 Yeah. Um, and I think one of the excursions was spending the day at Alani. Yeah. So the capacity of the ship combined with the capacity of the hotel was all here. Yeah, so there was a lot of people around. Obviously it did begin to quieten down in the evening yeah. didn't it, when everybody started to get back on the ship. Um, I think we walked in and it was like walking into Main Street. <laughs> yeah, um, but then also I think uh, with the jet bag added on top, I was very um, tired. it was a bit uh, sleepy where you know, yeah. So, um, yeah, we didn't really film too much yesterday. Um, but we are currently just sat by the pool uh, with a coffee um, oh, this morning. The time is currently... Six o'clock? Uh, oh, seven o'clock. 6.53. Yes, it's, it's nearly seven o'clock now. Um, but let's just show you. So we're sat on a wall, but just... Let's just show you the view. It's insane. So this is the view that we're currently looking at. That's the off the hook uh, cafe yeah. where they do breakfast. And that obviously coffees. goes around to one side of the hotel. And then yeah, this way we've got the beach just the other side of those chairs. You can kind of see the sea in the distance. This is obviously the pool which opens at 8 o'clock. And then it goes all the way around, all the way around, and then obviously back around to that side of the hotel. Yeah, it's a lovely, lovely morning here in Hawaii. Uh, the skies are beautifully blue. The sun is slowly coming out. And I feel like it's going to be a bit of a hot one. Yeah, what are we doing? Are we going to just chill by the pool nothing, today? We're doing nothing. Just chilling. By the pool? By oh. the pool. We'll go on the lazy river. Eat some Dull Whip. Eat some shaven ice. Yeah, shave ice. Shave ice. We'll show you that later. It looks cool. Cool. Catch you in a bit. Bye. We've just noticed Pluto and Max. So we're just going to go around and see if we can. <laughs> yeah, character Max. But we're just going to go around and see if we can quickly spot him a bit closer. <laughs> We've decided to come to the Infinity Pool Spa, Spa, Sauna, Hot Tub. Infinity Hot Tub. Look at this though. So there's another level up there. And then this is the view. We've come to Off The Hook Grill. I've got a tropical Mai Tai. Max has got a... Lava Flow. I think if ever you've had a pina colada at Disney, it's one of them just with a different name. It's got alcohol in it. Yeah. Oh. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you, Shave Eyes. So, what's in it? So it's basically Shave and Eyes. Turn him round with yes. Oh, bloody bird wants some. Um, obviously flavored syrups, and you've got a choice of like fifteen different flavored syrups. Um, we've gone for passion fruit, orange, and guava. Um. Take which, what, what's that? 
So, I think that's Suave. Orange and passion fruit, I think, possibly. That's guava. That's guava. That's passion fruit that end. This side. Mm -hmm. Oh wow. Mm. And then this is orange. Most of the flavours are sinking in. Yeah, it's like all in the middle, isn't it? This is the end result. <laughs> After a few minutes of sitting in the sun. Is this slush puppy? Poor Mickey. What we got? We got no way. This is pineapple and watermelon swirl. Do they do that in Disney World? Uh, they do do different flavours, don't they? Because I think, did we have a well, obviously we pineapple? Do, we're, yeah, we have a pineapple one. And that's lime? Oh, uh, sure, there was a different flavour. I can't remember the watermelon one. No, I don't think we did watermelon. It's melting very fast, so you better get this around your mouth. While we're eating our doll whip, we're just taking a stroll down the little cove so you've got that's the four seasons next to Ulani and then here's the beach for the two resorts but we've just read on the map that all of this beach is reserved for Co is it say Coalina? Yeah so I think that's like the gated area that the hotel's in um, as you like come to the resort. Yeah, so when you come into Alani itself, you've, there's a security gate, but there's loads of different hotels, hotels. within the property and also a yeah. golf course. So I think it's like a privately owned, what, peninsula type thing? Yeah, possibly. Just taking a little stroll down, see if we can see any seals or turtles. We've made it into the storm. Halloween pins. So they're currently, because it's near Halloween, doing a Pluto's Pumpkin Pursuit 2023. So you have to go around the resort to try and find different pumpkins. And I think the pumpkins are different Disney characters. So if we come back here, hidden all the way there, is a Moana themed pumpkin. They've got different styles as well. They've got that one with the Menahuni. Yeah. All the different Alani years. These are all Alani exclusive, I think, now. I might say so. Yeah, it's they are. Yeah. They're aligning on them. They are $35. Oh, and they've yeah. little Mickey's. I really want this lamp. They're in every room, but you won't fit in the case. Look at their lamp mini. Mickey. But Mickey lamp. Mickey lamp. <gasps> Oh, there you go. Christmas decorations. Oh. Disney 100. Oh, these are Disney 100 years as well. Oh, and it's got a line on it. Yeah. These are 
Fly flies a few. Oh, they come to play. Oh. That's quite a nice colour. It's good with the tan. Stitch. Big old stitch. We've got an Ulumel one. A Disney friend of Duffy. There he is. There he is. Ulumel. I do like this one. Yeah, it's a nice colour, isn't it? Yeah. This stitched lamb fly. Eating ice cream. He smells of ice creams and sweets. <laughs> Imagine if you're wearing that and someone's coming up to you, sniffing your bag. <laughs> it wouldn't be great. Here he is eating the same ice cream on the back of a spirit jersey. This is like the stitch. Here he is. Uh, what have you, what's that snap called? Band. Snap band. <laughs> uh, is he the pusher? Yeah. Oh, is it a duffel? Oh, he's a duffel bag! Uh, he holds on to you. There you go, Alex. Why don't you take that to the gym? Mm. Oh, we need to get a magnet. Oh, this is Stella Lou. There he is. Wait. Duffy. Duffy the bear is Mickey Mouse's teddy bear, isn't he? Yeah, he is. Oh, he's got a little... Yeah. Just and then I assume all the other teddy bears oh, are his friend. other people. Yeah. So... I probably got it completely wrong. We, yeah. I don't, we don't actually know, so sorry if we are giving you different information. Mm. Who knows? If you enter Ulu Mal, it's a perfect case. <laughs> it's two hundred and twenty-five dollars. Wow. Gosh. And it's not like a massive case, really. Here he is on the land fly. Alex is taking up the ukulele. So we have just realised that we didn't really keep you updated as to what the plan of attack was for the evening. Uh, so we just popped down to the shop um, and then we have just picked up some food from the quick service uh, and then we just brought it <laughs> to the room. So quick service, Alex has picked up a kid's chicken tenders meal um, with a chicken Caesar salad. Um, but he's saying he's got celery and carrots with it, some very bendy carrots by the looks of things, and then I've just got some chicken strips uh, as well. So we are just going to watch a bit of TV, uh, excuse the suitcases, um, and then yeah, just eat these and then have a early night because I think we're still a little jet lagged down. We are. We're going to make, uh, make, we're going to watch Making the Disney Wish. Ah, yes, because so it's that not should be good. on Disney Plus in the UK, it's for some bizarre reason, so Which I've been wanting to watch it. It's a shame. All right, catch you in a bit. Good morning, everyone. It's our second to last day here. It's our last full day here. We leave for the Disney Wonder tomorrow. One thing I will say, though, people are up very, very early putting towels on their sunbeds. It's like, I got up at half five and there's people already putting towels on their sunbeds. That's fine if you're gonna use them. Yesterday we were sat down from eight o'clock until two and the row where we were sat, there was towels on the sunbed and people never came. That's bad. 
and I'm sorry if the videos don't really link into each other. I just kind of forget and then go to sleep. So I'm sorry about that. But I've got my morning cappuccino from the Off The Hook Cafe. Um, and I've realized I've not really shown you around the resort yet. So whilst it's quiet, we'll uh, go for a little tour. So just next to where I was stood, by the way, I'm stood up here next to the Ulu Cafe. It's a little seating area for you to come and eat after you've gone to the uh, quick service restaurant over there, which is next to the, I'm gonna call this the main pool. There are several pools, but this seems to be the place where everyone congregates around. But next to it, you've got the Rainbow Reef pool, which uh, you have to pay for, but it's uh, snorkeling, I maybe scuba diving, I don't know. Um, but there's loads of fish in there, which you can go s snorkeling with. And you rent everything from the Rainbow Reef Rentals. By the way, they've got all the Halloween stuff up. All the pumpkins. So just down the stairs where we just come down, there's the main pool. You've got your restrooms just there. Mama's snack shop, I'll show you the menu. <laughs> That's open 11 till 5. Next to this, you would have seen the shave ice we had yesterday. But this is the uh, shave ice stop. All those flavours, I don't know what some of them flavours are, but. And next to the restrooms, you've got the Lava Shack. It's a little shop which has got, um, like loads of swim stuff in there, sun creams, swimsuits, goggles. And then in here is that, the Rainbow Reef pool, but it's the viewing area for it. So as you can see, all the fishies. So you can go snorkeling with them. Oh, every day you stay in here, by the way, you need to get yourself a little wristband, where's mine? There you go. Every day they change colour, but to get them, it's open from 8 a.m. You have to just scan your room key. At this stop, they give you towels and a new daily wristband. This is the kids' splash pad playing area. I mean, it's pretty impressive for a kids' play area, let's be honest. Aquatic play area, this is called. Oh, there you go, you've got a high restriction. But to be fair, I saw kids in here a lot smaller than that. It's pretty impressive. Oh, look at the glow of the sun coming up. This is where one of the uh, the start of the laser with it. You can get on here, zero entry. I spy a Max. Max! <laughs> Hi! Oh, that's really nice. That is real, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Wow. Well, you've also got the entry to the slide here and then the exit. <laughs> Fall in. It's just there. Oh, beautiful. You've also got a water refill station. Hi. And they've also all got wheelchair accessible ramps. If 
to wear as well. This is the bridge which goes over the Lazy River. And I'm sure, was it on one of these bridges it's got? Yeah, there you go. 1923. 100 years of Disney. It's one of the hot tubs. Lovely. Again, they've got accessible chairs to get into the hot tub as well. Oh, just look at that. Look at the sun hitting the building. This is the other side of the kids' pool, by the way, so you've got all of the deck chairs for you to sit on whilst you watch your kid playing. And they've got a little slide. And they've all got the fancy deck chairs as well, which I assume you pay more for. A little cabana. Oh, they've got a TV in the cabanas. Yeah, it looks like they have. Got a cabana in there, light ceiling fan, mini fridge and safe. I think there's a bird on the roof. Charging ports. Those are the prices, open 10 till 3. Oh, there's the uh, cabana price. <gasps> All deck cabana rentals, $550. Bulu Cafe, which is the quick service. We've decided to get a cinnamon roll before they all sell out. Interesting fact, we were talking to a cast member in here yesterday and they said that this used to be a uh, two-bedroom villa or one-bedroom villa and they turned it into a quick service. There's the breakfast menu and then this is the all-day menu from 11. So we've come to Off The Hook Cafe. I keep calling it Off The Hook Cafe. I don't know if it's just called Off The Hook uh, for breakfast. And this is what we've got. I've gone for the kids one egg scrambled with sausage and... Ooh. What's that? Is that scrambled? <laughs> it's like an omelette. Mm. <laughs> with sausage and potatoes. But this is the kids breakfast. You get three sausages and a drink with it as well. And Ma <gasps> Max has got Mickey waffles with sausage. I'll give you an ear. Oh, thanks. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mickey beer. <gasps> Mm -mm -mm. This is the current view. You stitch. People, oh, what are them? They're like the male version of the lady. Aww. 
people come up and put their lays on to stitch. Wonder if it's people who have left. Possibly. These corridors have such a nice smell. It's like a pineapple y, strawberry orange smell, and I think they come from there. Mm -mm. There's the river. We are currently just walking down There's the, the drive. Lobby. There's the lobby, yeah. Uh, we're just walking down the drive uh, to the main road, and then we're just going to go cross over and go to the shops that are just opposite the hotel. Um, there's a Starbucks, a little market, a restaurant. There's quite a few shops, isn't there? A few little, there? yeah, clothes shops and stuff. But um, the, the market is a ABC store. That's right, isn't it? I have no idea. Um, but they've got loads of fresh food in there like wraps, salad, sushi and it's a lot cheaper than the prices in Milani. So we thought for lunch we'd walk down here and get some food. Yeah so we're just going to go grab a wrap, uh, grab a Starbucks. That's the entrance to Alani and then that's where all the stores are. Black sheep ice cream, Starbucks next door. What's that called? Monkey Pod Kitchen? Oh, they are all the beers. Here's the food. Pizzas. Fresh fish. Fresh fish from the farm field and ranches. Ah, burgers. Oh, pork tacos. Has made gnocchi. It looks like they do takeout as well. And they've got pineapple boutique. Closed store. And they're opening a Soha Living. In Olani, they've got um, candles and stuff like that. In here. Longboard letters. Oh, that's cute. And then this is the market store. Island Country Market by ABC Stores. Oh, 
We bought some food from the market. We've got a mini mandarin chicken salad and a honey Dijon turkey wrap. Obviously we've called into Starbucks. Got myself a ice blonde roast caramel latte and a white chocolate mocha. Got ourselves some new Starbucks mugs. This is mine, Aloha Vibes. This is Max's. Okay. Although, all now Max has got that one. I don't know if I prefer Max's. Standard. <laughs> so, <laughs> we've decided to come paddle board in. <laughs> I've never paddle board before in my life. <laughs> oh dear. wedding chapel and if Alex moves his head uh, there is a wedding going on actually just there I don't know if you can see off in the distance at the bottom of the steps um, so yeah so you can come here and have this as your backdrop to your wedding good enjoyed it so that's where you take on the bottom out of breath this is where you rent them from at the beach rentals right in front of where you pick them up. We're just on our way to see if we can catch the sunset from uh, one of the other little, what Peninsulas. are they called, caves, peninsulas? It's definitely approaching golden hour. Look at the light. <laughs> it's all nice. special isn't it? So we're walking to that peninsula over there. So there's a lining. There. This is the Four Seasons and it's just past there. So we've made it to the end of the peninsula. The line is in the background. Just here, down my head. We've literally got that gold now glow going on. And it's just the perfect end to our stay at Alani. Tomorrow, uh, check them for the cruise, can we? Yeah, this so afternoon. it's really easy if you get an A Disney cruise from Alani and you've booked transfers with them. Um, we went, went to the conference centre, they had our names, they gave us our luggage tags. We got to choose which coach we wanted to go on. About what time slot was yeah, it? Yeah, which time slot. Um, and it was all done from there. And that was the check-in process. So tomorrow we go to the port, go through security, all the check-ins already done at Ulani. Literally, it's paradise. It is paradise. Um, it's stunning. 
yeah, the result's great, isn't it? And um, we both said like we're sad that we haven't got like some more days day, here. Yeah. Um, I think everything that they've done within the resort is really well thought out, and the theming is amazing. Yeah, yeah. The cast members here are brilliant. They're lovely. They're all fantastic. Yeah. Um, the only thing I will say is it's very busy, and we saw quite a lot of people walking around disappointed because they couldn't get sun lounges because they'd already been taken throughout the day. But other than that, it's it's yeah. amazing. And I'd love to like to go and explore a bit of the island a bit more. Yeah, that's the only but... thing that we said. We we haven't really had a, a lot of time here to go exploring. Yeah. But hey ho, yeah. just have to come back. Just turn the camera around and show everyone that's come out to this peninsula. Well. So that's that, we're going to chill now, watch the sunset and we will see you in another episode for us checking in for the Disney Wonder to Sydney. Sydney, yay. See you then.